hi guys welcome back to my channel welcome back to the african print channel where we do all things african print so today i'm going to be showing you how to make this necklace it's a triple layer necklace it's a layer of just uh, three fabrics with binding it's very simple so let's get started so these are my fabric pieces you start off with three fabric pieces you can even do four if you want and if and they're all different sizes then you fold the fabric two times then I just put those pegs on the sides to hold it in place then I started to measure from the top corner just going right round so that when I cut it I get a round shape and then I just did my markings then I took my scissors and then I cut it like that And then so I measured my neck the circumference of my neck was about 14 inches and then you divide that by 6.28 and I got about 2.2 inches which I started to mark from the top corner and then I cut it out then I did the same thing for the two remaining fabric pieces So there are all my three little pieces of fabric all cut out and all done. Then I just started opening them up one by one, putting them face up. Then I started to put them on top of each other. So because they are different sizes, now you get that layered effect. And then I went on to one end and then I just cut straight across to make for the opening of the needles. Then I now took my fabric pieces one by one and then I'll take my curved ruler and just go on the corner of each one and then I'll just draw a small curve and then I'll cut it out with the scissors and I did the same thing for the other two remaining pieces. Then I now took my binding now. This is my binding, store-bought binding. Then I just started going on the edge of the circular fabrics like that. And then I'll just put those little pegs as I went along. This was just to help me when I go to sew on the sewing machine. Then I now started to sew the binding onto the edge of the fabric. So at first I was putting the pegs, but then in the end, I got a little bit more familiar with the binding and I just started to just sew it on, put it on and just sew. So you just do what makes it easy for you. Then I also put binding on the other two remaining pieces.
So there were all my three fabrics done. I sewed on binding on all the edges, then I laid them on top of each other like that. Then I now took my binding again and then I started going over the edges, starting from the point where I cut the opening right all through to the center. The whole center, I also put binding. Uh, basically putting all three layers of fabric together and then putting the binding over them if it makes it easy for you you can attach like a small you can attach a small um band neck band like as if like you're making a waistband for a skirt then you can just do that on the neckline but i just chose to use binding because it was much simpler then after that i did a tucking stitch because here i was working with many fabrics with many fabric layers i had to do the tucking stitch and just make sure that I'm getting all the layers of fabric together. And then my tucking was done. Then I now just took it to the sewing machine and then I sewed it all over. So that was basically the end. So I, to fasten, I used uh, these little buttons and loops. You can also use press studs or velcro depending on what you have but anyway thank you so much for watching this video guys so this is going to be my next video which i'm going to upload the day after tomorrow so please make sure to also check that out bye